Hello everyone, welcome to another tribute video once again. So in today's tribute video, this is going to be a tribute video for, to, to this animation company, which, which most of us know, of course. It was, it was owned by 20th Century Fox, which is now known as 20th Century Studios. And, and, the, and the animation company was founded on February 22nd, 1987, and it was founded by Chris Wedge. And, and of course, that would be Blue Sky Studios. So if you don't know, Blue Sky Studios is an animation company founded in 1987, like I said. And the, com and, and, and the company was known for making the, the very first short film, which won an Oscar for Best Animated Short Film in 1998, Bunny. And then, of course, the, the success of Bunny gave Blue Sky Studios the opportunity to make movies, starting with the, first, the very first Ice Age movie that came out on March 15, 2002. And, and, and of course, it was a huge, it was, it was a hit for, it was, it was a hit for moviegoers, critics, and, and the box office. So, and then, of course, the, the company also did their, made their second movie, Robots, which was, which was the, ver the, the first Blue Sky Studios movie I saw in theaters, Robots. And then they did a, a sequel to Ice Age, The Meltdown. And then they made a Dr. Seuss movie based on Horton Hears a Who, starring Jim Carrey and Steve Carell, and Carol Burnett, Will Arnett, um, and Amy Poehler. And the company also did a, a bunch of other movies, like Rio and Rio 2. Um, and of course, Ice Age, Dawn of the Dinosaurs, where we got Scratte, the female squirrel, and Scrat's love interest. And then... And they... And Blue Sky also also did the 2013 movie Rio. Actually, excuse me, not Rio. I already said that. I meant the 2013 movie Epic. And then they also did um, Ferdinand back in 2017. And also, we cannot forget about the Peanuts movie, the Charlie Brown movie, the Peanuts movie. That was a really good. That was a great movie. One of my one of my favorites of 2015. But then of course, and then of course they got like Ice Age Continental Drift, and then Ice Age Collision Course. Which was, yeah, Ice Age Collision Course, and then, and then, and then their next movie after that in, in twenty seventeen was like I said, Ferdinand, which I remember seeing in theaters, and of course their last movie, their last movie came out on on Christmas Day of twenty nineteen, and, and their last movie that came out on Christmas Day of twenty nineteen is starring Will, Will Smith and Tom Holland, and that <laughs> oh my god. Okay, guys. So, so I apologize. I apologize for 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 my for my reaction there. It was just it, that was just my dog. That was just my dog Louie making sudden move, making sudden moves and movements. So anyway, as I was gonna say, Blue Sky Studios' last movie they did was 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 called Spies in Disguise, and and I do remember seeing that movie in theaters too. Yeah. So, so I yeah I, I I remember seeing Spies in Disguise in theaters, and so. Spies in Disguise was was the last mo the last movie that Blue Sky Studios released in theaters, and and then of course and then of course here comes the here comes some really really ma really big major change to this, because 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 from from what I from what I just read on, on on social media like on Facebook that the Walt Disney Company that that owns Fox now, like Disney like AKA the Walt Disney Company that they actually they actually shut down Blue Sky Studios. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not kidding. I'm not lying. This is no, this is no joke, not a lie. And because this is real, it's true. Blue Sky Studios is gone for good, thanks to Disney. And I'm pretty sure they're gonna have to can. I'm pretty sure they're gonna have to cancel the 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 the, the, the spinoff Ice Age movie that that comes out in Disney Plus, and they might have to cancel their next movie in 2022, next year in January, like Nimona. Yeah. And, I also recently heard that Karen Disher was supposed to direct a, a Blue Sky Studios movie with Steve Martino, but I think they're gonna have to cancel that movie too because Disney Disney closed Blue Sky Studios for good, and Blue Sky Studios has only made thirteen movies. Oh, but but Blue Sky Studios also did other short films besides Bunny. They did some scratch shorts like Gone Nutty and No Time for Nuts, Scratch Continental Crack Up Parts One and Two. But yeah, so Blue Sky Studios was a great company, and we're all gonna miss it so much. So, and it is kind of sad that that Blue Sky Studios is gone for good.
but yeah, so, so, so and, and that's, and that's the point of, 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 of this tribute video for Blue Sky Studios, because, and I, I almost have, I almost have every ice, I, I almost have, I almost have every Blue Sky Studios movie on DVD and Blu-ray. Almost all of them. Not all, just, just some of them. Most of them, pretty much. But yeah, so... So yeah, guys, we're all, we're all gonna miss Blue Sky Studios. It was, it was a great animation company, and... Yeah, so... So there you have it, guys. So, so that's gonna be it for this tribute video for, for Blue Sky Studios. And so that's gonna be it for this video. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up and, subs and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And as always, thanks for watching. And until next time, goodbye everybody and that's about it.